back to another wiper battle. You guys voted on horse week. We're having a horse week. We're gonna lose a lot of battles, and I'm gonna take it like a man, like a horse, a stud, like a stallion. I think I'll leave. I, have, I have two stallions, and the one that should be stallion is a female. So, whatever. But yeah, I mean, the team is as follows: is a quick or um, what is it? Um, Scarred variant of Spectre. Uh, I'm a Assaultless variant of Keldio. Um, Expert belt of uh, Nagir. Uh, I think it's called it, Nagir. Um, Mud Cells is a classic uh, self rock toxic variant. Uh, power Herb, Solar Blade, um, I was gonna say Power of Facts, but now it's called Rapidash. And uh, Ulysses here, my Galarian Rapidash, is actually a Trick Room Setter for Tangos. Uh, has Healing Wish, uh, Future Sight, and whatnot. It, it's a weird set, and I really, really think it's not gonna do anything pleasant. Um, now, when we went to this first battle, or this battle, we had... I laid off with Kelio, he laid off with Spectre, so... That's what we're gonna do, and hopefully it works out. And also to Rudy, you know, good luck, have fun. Um, I am slightly worried about this matchup, because the, the team he has looks good. Uh, it's... It's synergized, I mean, the horses only takes you so far. <laughs> so it starts off with Scary Horses Spectre, and uh, I have really yet to make up my mind what I want to do to um, do to this. I am supposed to survive a hit from it. Hydro Pump should do good damage, but a Flip Turn should allow me to, uh, to get some nice momentum. But I always will be slower, so I don't know. This is probably my only big chance of actually getting a hit on it, so go for Hydro Pump. He thinks that makes me more worried. Shadow Ball. I'm basically sack playing Kelly. I realize that as I make this play. Oh no, 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 we're in this. We're in this. There we go. Nice. Nice. How much will the Hydro Pump do? Oh, oh. Where is your switch in now, son? Where are they? I'll just flip turn here. He's he has to be scarfed. I can't think of anything but scarfed. So he withdraws, which is fair. And uh, bring in Pringles. That's unfortunate. He should have. That's unfortunate. I don't like that at all, actually. Um, <laughs> should I bring my own Spectre? I, I, I don't want to switch in for this. I think Shadow Ball is quite, like, free. But I think my Shadow Ball is scarier than his. That kind of sucks, he got me, like, I I thought I had a superior play, but no, 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 Jellicent is Jellicent, after all. So he shoots Shadow Ball here, I think it's... You know what, I'm good with that. Man, if I... <laughs> oh, it would have been nice if I actually got this play right. Getting the flash fire on my, um... Let's see, what are switches here? Double kind of comes in there and you say nay. If I were him, I switch out. So I'm gonna bring in my Grass Strayer and actually a Soul Stance on the double. Did he stay in? Absolute mad lad. Hex. Okay. Did not expect that. Ooh. He hexed on me. This guy, though, this guy. That, I did not expect that. I'll just nuke him. I think he stays in go for a scold. So <laughs> I'll just take his, make as big of a splash as I can. <laughs> to be honest, I want to have a soul stance behind this because I know it won't break him, but it will do a good amount of damage. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we're in this. Here comes the skull. I don't believe we survive that. No. No, we're not. But, but, I would be lying if I didn't think that, that that's a broken Pringles and I killed you switching no more. <sighs> more in theory, it's still active, I guess. It's not like I can take him out with Elysius. I can't do that with you either. And the rest are just getting back. So I'm gonna lock myself into dark pools because at least if I do in that, I get the damage on um, the, other, the other bastard too. I was gonna say, but no, I have no idea what he wants to do. I really, really want to find a way to break um, 
Ah, uh, that's gonna be a problematic mon, actually. The dub wool is actually looking scarier than ever. So he does decide to sack it, which I think is fair. And uh, that will allow Kelio to be a lot more scarier. But... Like, like that's about it. <laughs> I think about it. Um, what are the switches to this? I mean, Moal comes in and that's it. I don't want to see Moal. I don't want to see it. Don't know why I said in the first time we eat a Rudy. Head game. Yeah, Moal. Don't like this guy. Plus, this guy can carry Sucker Punch. It can be extremely aggressive. Um, I don't think I'll lose anything by switching in Raiga. Uh, even, let's say, it's a Sucker Punch variant. Um, that means I'll just get my free switch in. I can actually set up Stealth Rocks. But at the same time, if he does decide to attack, I'm going to get my Stamina Boost, which would be great for me. Uh, but I'm not going to take that risk. I think the Sucker Punch is too obvious. And if he goes... Even if so, like he's safe to go with Stealth Rocks. Soul Stance. As worse. As way worse. And I will absolutely be slower than you. <laughs> um, okay, then I, I clearly earthquake. How much will this do? I am fully defensive. Oof. Oh, it is not. It is not convincing. <laughs> it's not convincing at all. Let's see. This earthquake will do. Oh, yeah, it's out. Boom, bada, boom. <laughs> it said nay. <laughs> so that's the leftovers. Just barely hanging on. Damn, that's rough, actually. I think about it. Only positive part is that we know he doesn't have uh, anything to set up self rocks. So my... Yeah, that's the thing, do not think about it. Huh. So, I mean, I am not in a good spot, no matter what, clearly. But um, my focus sash with Elysius, my Galeno Rapid, that he's actually intact. That could be interesting. <laughs> Depending on what he wants to do, that could be a thing. Um, scary horse. I'll say. He just shatter balls away. And... Uh, yeah, not that many convincing switch-ins. So I'm... I'm gonna set my no. I'm not, I'm not gonna do something weird now. Let me just die. <laughs> Let's see. Boom. He's gonna get himself in plus one. I can only assume, like I say here, that he is uh, in some fashion. Um, I cannot take a plus one. Do I want to risk that? I mean, I kind of do. I think I should be able to take one hit. I want to be able to do that. Let's see what he wants to do. Come on, Rudy. Yes, here we go. Please stomach this. I need you to do that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're, we're a chunky boy. We're a chunky boy, indeed. <laughs> so, maybe not high school spin, now I think about it, but uh, I thought it made sense when I picked it. Uh, <laughs> so, get my chilling nay. Nice. So, Salamence. No, you're, you're not bringing Salamence. Oh, we're bringing this guy. So, he's going to force me to that, don't he? Ah, this is, this is not pleasant. Because he will cut and guard, and then he will... Um, we got speed, which is nice. The question is, what he decided to do? It says he's slower. What move does he have that is slower than me? Counter. Oh, that's nasty. I, I went, I, I, he got me there, didn't he? <laughs> I 
That's um, that's unfortunate. I had a grander vision, to be honest. Um, okay. Okay. So, had I only sword stance, I was like, what did he decide to do? And what do you know? It worked. Right? Secret sword here. I think Salamence comes in. Even Frostmoth kind of um, pressures me. He does decide to stand, which is great for me. As that will absolutely take away that mon. Ugh. That's a scary... That's a scary mon. Let's see. We got the Ice Scales mon. And we got... Um, we got Salamence. There is no way Salamence is scuffed, though. I think. I hope. Maybe hope is better than thinking. At this point, I'm just... I do want Frostmoth with Keldeo to an extent. Quiver Dancing is just not that pleasant. That freaking duck will kind of kind of screw me over. I, I thought it was in way better position. I was thinking Cotton Guard Body Press, like everybody does. Lance. Yeah, that's a Lance. So, so how do I want to approach this? Ice Wind. I'll absolutely Ice Wind here. I won't kill him for sure, but basically, if you decide to um, go for Dragon Dance, be cheeky, I think you'll lose. Let's see. Ooh, that's a nay. Dragon Dance, yeah. I'll say it, I think it's cheeky. I think I like the call, it just. I know what he was going for. I know what he was trying to do. I mean, what are... 95% like... No, we're, we're not risking that. We, we're going for the hit. <laughs> he has to die by this. I am not gonna take that risk. <laughs> I simply am not. <laughs> like I said, I see what he was going for. I get it. Uh, now we come to the problematic part, and that is... Can I beat a Frostmoth? And the, the answer is probably not so much. I, I have no idea how much this Secret Soul will do. I know Frostmoth is frailer on the physical side. With eye scales and whatnot, it's clearly a chunky boy. So let's see. Yeah! Yeah, I was worried about this. I was very, very worried about this. So the only thing going here in my favor is that um, while I will always be slower, he can never recover. So there's a second one. So the question is, is this faster now? I'm actually going, I'm not gonna make something weird here. I think if it goes for the third, I really hope it goes for Bug Bus because I just wanna see if he's, if he's faster or not. Giga Drain. That's worse. It looked to be the right call though. Damn, did he recover a lot. Or, or maybe not, now that I think about it. Um, Shadow Ball. Just want to see if I'm faster or not. He fucking got me here, didn't he? I knew it. We were faster, which is nice. I think it just keeps quiver dancing freely. Now we get rains again. Goody. So yeah, he wins. This Frostmoth wins the game. <laughs> I won't deny it, it's... Um it's kind of cool. <laughs> it's actually kind of cool. Um, okay, I really hope it doesn't go for... Um, because I'll always be slower here. 
Please don't get rain. Rudy, come on. Yes, he bug buzzes. And hanging on to Sash. By the way, I can probably not take any hit from this guy in a way, so I'm still screwed. But I want to just to show what I was all about. So healing wish. Uh, damn it. Then again, like, I probably didn't have the means to stop Frostmoth anyway, not really leveling here. Giga Rain just really set it apart. I'm so accustomed to see Hurricane that, uh, yeah, I might have screwed myself over a little bit. But at the same time, I think Garuda did good here. Only thing I'm kind of going back and forth with is if I had the means to stop it. And I wonder, yeah, not a thing, but yeah, I did. And that was with, um, with my Chilling Nay Pokemon, which clearly didn't make it. Now, am I slower? Yes, so I crit and we're all good. Damn it. Damn it, Kelio. Now look, we're probably gonna survive this too. Yeah, yeah, because why not? <laughs> yeah, and a crit here won't save me. So GG to Rudy. That was, this is probably as good as this team will get. And uh, I think I got to start off good, but it just, ah, the Frostmoth was too much. And you'll never hear me say that again. The Giga Rangers gave it too much momentum back, and I couldn't beat it. So, too rude, I really mean this when I say it. GG, man. Very fun game. And um, the team provided a lot more than I thought it ever would do. And for me, that means a lot. <laughs> All the way for me of winning, like I said, it was probably being able to somehow... Or the intention was to get Trick Room and then the Healing Wish to my... Um, my Chilinier or whatever it's called, the, the, the Ice Horse, but that, that was probably the only way of actually stopping Frostmoth 2. I just failed to see it because I didn't expect it to rain. So, jam. Jam, he got me. <laughs> so, guys, always pick a watch and have a great day, everyone. Take care.